Welcome to Inside New York. It is a special night tonight in the theater world. We are at Woody King's New Federal Theater's 44th Anniversary Gala. And Danny Glover is one of the co-hosts who we'll be talking with, as well as all the stars that came out tonight to celebrate Woody King and the New Federal Theater. So you better stay right there because it's all right here on Inside New York. Welcome to Inside New York. <laughs> That's a great question. Thank you. Hi, this is Shaka Khan, and you're watching Inside New York. <laughs> I'm Danny Glover on Inside New York. And he's back with us. When did you first meet Woody? I must have met Woody about, Remember the about 34, 34 years ago. Okay, and like, was it for a play or were you just coming out to Man, I'm, I'm just trying to, I'm trying somebody to give me an audition. <laughs> <laughs> well, 34 years ago, what brought you to New Federal and Woody King? Well, well I, I, for 34 years ago, I did a, a showcase of a production uh, with with, uh, with Moses uh, producing of A Winter's Tale. Keith David was in it, myself, uh, 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 um, um, Reggie, Reggie was in it. So many different me men and women who went on to do other things. I can't remember the entire cast. We did a showcase of A Winter's Tale. And for me, it's the first time that I was on stage doing, doing uh, Shakespeare, you know, on the Shakespeare on the one hand, and feeling comfortable with the, the, the the, the images, feeling comfortable with the language, was something that certainly was instrumental in my own career. Because once you become comfortable with that language, you can be comfortable with anything, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. And so I think that was a, that was a, that was a beginning point for me. My That's name right. is Melba Joyce, and I want to say a word about Bosa Rivers, one of the greatest producers I've ever met. He's produced me so many times over and over again. He really is ex an extraordinary person. <laughs> Theater right here. California. I'm waiting for you to come back and we're going to have it on YouTube in a minute. Yeah, California. Somebody called me the other day and said, Oh, I heard you on, on uh, the radio. I said, When? Television. I said, Oh, that must be Jones uh, program. Hey, there are people who say now there's no need for black theater. Uh, what would you say to them? You know, because so many of black shows can still be that, produced in mainstream. That's BS. Anybody who don't recognize it still the need for black theater, it gotta be uh, full of, you know what I'm saying. Because, in fact, we need places like black producers more than even before. Because what's being done now, we're back in the hands of other people, and we don't have all of the institutions that we had. 30 years ago. We're here with Joy Sylvester, who's working now with Woody King yes. at the New Federal Theater. And we had the pleasure of having her in the studio. And you were talking about a special connection between Woody and um, Douglas, Turner, Douglas Turner, Ward. Turner Ward. Yes. Yes, well, uh, Woody King had asked Douglas Turner Ward to teach a playwright workshop when I had just come back from California. And I just had my play Mercedes produced, and he asked me, did I want to take a class? So I said, well, you know, I already had a play produced. So he said, uh, Douglas Turner Ward is teaching the class. I said, oh, I'll be in the class. And from then on, I've had uh, five more plays produced. Uh, in, Very? In, uh, you know, at the uh, National Black Theater Festival and also uh, Marjorie Moon's Billy Holiday Theater. Yes. So, Bolter, what does it mean tonight to be honored and, you know, the, the, the okay. this 40th anniversary of the new federal okay theater. this is new uh this is new federal theater's 44th anniversary and what an honor as i celebrate my 50th anniversary that they have included me in their special day it also says a lot about the remarkable imprint that new heritage has uh put on the communities of color all throughout the city and globally thank you and you got so much love for those people who say we don't need black theater, what do you say? 
Uh, black theater is as necessary as the air that you breathe. Thank All you. All right, and we look to see more of it at New Heritage. Thank you.